My dear students, welcome to Unit 4, Week 6, that extends from March 31st till April 4th uh, in your INS course. We are going to start this week with a formative. The formative is going to be two parts of research, two parts of presentation. We're going to investigate a specific example of a cultural genre, sport, music, politics, gender, for example, and use a range of examples within that genre. Our word wall is going to include cultural genre, investigation, examples, diversity, representation, analysis, interpretation, significance, context, tradition, innovation, identity, expression, stereotypes, and subculture. You're going to watch a video about different cultural genres within music. And you're going to have an interactive activity related to that. You're going to explain the different ways that culture affects our identity and society. You're going to investigate a specific example of a cultural genre, sport, politics, music, gender, for example, and use a range of examples within that genre. You're going to need to thoroughly and explicitly investigate your chosen genre and produce a well-supported theoretical argument as a way of explanation. You're going to present your argument in the form of a research. There are ideas to consider what are the different ways culture can affect our identity, how is culture expressed, explain the impact of this. Culture can be visible, invisible, material, or subculture, multicultural, how is culture changed across time, place, and space? Who is affected? Is everyone affected in the same way? Does everyone see the aspect of culture and examples given in the same way? This is your perspective. You're going to watch about a video about different cultural genres within sport now. And you will have an interactive activity related to that. A further practice. And for the challenging question this time, I've, I put, uh, I assigned a link where you're going to uh, answer the challenging questions within the link. You're going to have a self-assessment. And for what you do tomorrow, I would like you to revise and proofread your research paper. For part two of your formative, um, you're going to continue with uh, doing your research. In this page, you're going to watch a video about cultural dances and have an interactive activity related to that. And then you are going to watch a video about food and culture and have an interactive or activity related to that. Further practice, challenging question. Again, I put you a link uh, so that you can answer the questions uh, using the link, a self-assessment. Now you're going to prepare for your formative presentation. For less than three in this week, you're going to deliver an engaging and impactful presentation across various settings and audiences. Uh, our word world is going to include deliver, engaging, impactful presentation and criteria. Uh, you're going to have rubrics. I'm going to show you the rubrics. I'm going to uh, uh, concentrate on your delivery, on your content and organization, on your enthusiasm, order and awareness, um, uh, audience awareness, sorry. You're going to have four marks. One means needs improvement, two is fair, three is good, and four is excellent. Um, you're going to watch a video about how to deliver an engaging and impactful presentation. You will have an interactive activity. Uh, you can craft your presentation through Prizi or through PowerPoint, it's up to you. Uh, you're going to watch a video about how to master your presentation, uh, an interactive activity related to that, and further practice, of course, challenging questions. Again, you have a link and a self-assessment quiz. For um, what to do tomorrow, you're going to revise everything you took. Uh, click on the picture to take you to the activity. I can't wait to start this fruitful uh, week with you guys. All the love and respect. Peace out.